Okay, so there's Jody Mail. Yeah. Oh my God. It says, flying may not be all plain sailing, but the fun is worth the price. Amelia Earhart. Wear your bike pants. Maybe doing dancing or something? While well, flying? Dancing yeah. Flying. The hell? That sort of sent us all on a bit of a head spin because we're like, why do you need bike pants? We sort of had all different ideas. Someone thought we might be riding a bike in the air or something. <laughs> like E.T. <laughs> When we first drove in, you could just see like this big, it looked like sort of a warehouse, but it said theatre on the top of it, and I was like thinking that it was going to be something to do um, with dance or something like that. Ladies, welcome to your weekly photo shoot. This week's been all about your body, dancing, learning to move. Today, I want to see how that body reacts in what I'm going to call an extreme fashion situation. And then um, Jonathan pushed open the big warehouse door and he walked in and you couldn't really see anything. It was just bare. But then I looked closer and you could sort of see just this thing is dangling from the roof. Oh my God! And there it was. We saw something hanging from the roof that looked like possibly we could be hanging from that thing. Oh my God! Thank you! And everyone was like, oh my God! And I was like... God, no way. Holy crap, moly. <laughs> it's harness time here. How are you going? Yeah? Excited? Um, what? A little bit. A little bit? Yeah, like hot. Oh, really? You gonna be okay? You push through it, yeah? You can do it, honey. And then there's Jordan, who also was very panicky. She was very nervous because she's also got a fear of heights. So, you know, to start off the day, we've already got two models down. They're crying because they're, they're scared of heights. So I'm like, oh, my God, <laughs> it's going to be an interesting shoot. <laughs> this over here is where the girls are. The photographer, Dean, yeah, he was awesome. He was hilarious. I loved him. Yeah, make it wide. When I first met Dean, I thought he was a wacko. I really thought he was on drugs or something. He was crazy. But um, as I got to know him through the day, he was a pretty nice guy. Uh, today, my mission is to create a classic, beautiful, old-school image um, with a contemporary twist. It could be quite challenging for the girls um, because the harness is quite... It's about a five minute drop with concrete underneath. If it was me up there, I'd be having fun, but uh, yeah. Okay, second thoughts, everyone. <laughs> On second thoughts, I'm going to go to the toilet and never come out. <laughs> Jordan, you're... Have you seen The Matrix? Yeah. The man in charge of you today, the man in charge of The Matrix. Really? Did anyone die on The Matrix? <laughs> yeah. The concept for today is an out there Mary Poppins. You're going to be up in this rig. We need to believe that you're flying. That's it. The shortest straw will go first. Phew. That'll be last. Oh. That'll be first. When I did the first straw, I was like, ah, oh, great. But then at the same time, I was like, at least now I'm going to get it over and done with. One, two, three. I knew the first bit would be the scariest, like, just because I had nothing to hold on to, and I just, I didn't know what to do with my hands. And then I, I thought I was going to cry for a second because I was like, oh, God. And then I was like, no, just do it. The quicker you do it, the quicker you get down. OK, Steph, ready? One, two, three. Go, go, go. I'm losing your umbrella. I think I kept bending one leg in the wrong way, so it kept looking like a knob which would be really unattractive. Extend, Steph. Extend right out. It's just really hard because, like, once you're up there, you forget everything that you got told down on the ground because you're like, OK, keep your hand out, keep doing this, keep doing that. And there's always, like, one little thing that you forget. 
But um, I think by the end of it, I remembered to keep it out, hopefully. Yeah, nice! <laughs> That was the hardest shoot I've ever done, but at the same time, that was the funnest shoot I've ever done. One, two, three. When I got up in the air, I took on a fairly strong pose of pointing my toes and really holding my leg like a ballerina. I found it quite easy, maybe because I've got a lot more body strength than what the other girls do. Okay, let it drag, let it drag. Dean, the photographer, I swear to God, I almost hit him in the head so many times. He, like, had to duck. You're all fucking hell. Why me, Charlie? It scared the hell out of me when he started swearing. I was like, oh, my God, <laughs> what have I done? But it was just him. He, he said he'd missed the shot or something, and he gets quite upset when he misses a good shot. So, yeah, he was, he was kind of funny. How's your crutch? Yeah, it's cool. <laughs> Thanks for asking. <laughs> I'm apprehensive about today's photo shoot. Why is that? Um, like, no matter what you do, you come out with a, a gorgeous photo. Like, you're, you're amazing in front of the camera and you come out beautifully in front of the camera. You know what I mean? Two, three! Yeah, Alice was quite stiff today. Try and hand like that. There you go. I don't think she performed at all. And I was really disappointed because I thought she'd be one of the girls that would do fantastic because she wasn't scared at all. The photo shoot, although like you knew that it would look amazing, was, was very uncomfortable and quite painful. I found it very, very, very difficult to control the movement. Relax that top hand, Alice. Relax it. I felt like I was being a bit of a baby, but I couldn't help it. I was trying so hard, but I didn't feel like it was good enough. Ah, kill her! The photo is really good. It'll be amazing. <laughs> Luckily, photography is all about just one split second, and no one ever remembers how it was made. Yeah. <laughs> I'm centered. Jordan nailed it. That's it, Jordy. Give him the look. Yeah. God, I was jealous of Jordan. She was so good, and I was just sitting there going, damn, why didn't I do that? Damn it. <laughs> I can't keep going on being fearful of everything. And so I just kind of thought, you know, just let it go. And just if you friggin' fall, then it was meant to be. So, and I was fine. So <laughs> I'm stuck. Yeah, nice. Work the umbrella. I like it. Um, I think Jordan went really well. Um, she did something different, like, all the time. And she moved her body nearly just as much as what I wanted to. I have noticed that everyone seems to be on their own, um, like not fooling around with each other anymore. They just wanted to do their own thing. So in essence, I think it's just showing that the competition is getting, getting harder and um, the girls getting more serious about it.